Mm. <laughs> like, I could... You know how many different felonies you can get from this? It's organized retail theft, basically, is what it is. Whether it was your idea or not, you went along with it. Did you get dropped off here, or is your vehicle in the... My vehicle's here. Okay. Hey, um, I'm getting ready to go to jail. Mm. Someone come get it. The way she did it, I have a feeling that this is not the first time. I'm sure. And she wouldn't give y'all her. She wouldn't give y'all her aunt's name. I don't. It looks like I was down on my looking to hit me a lick, ready to get into some. Since I was a jit, I had big dreams of getting rich. Now we leveling up in this. Take a look at my kids. You know we stepping on toughest. The first one to get hit don't make me send a blitz. My head is itching for it. How long to spit like a list? But wait. Whoa. Whoa, now what's the mother friend of Kitten deal? Welcome back to Sheldon's Bullet Gas Studio where we come to kick it, vibe out, and shoot the shit with Sheldon, man. I appreciate each and every last one of y'all for pulling up. Do me a favor, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Let's get up into this video today. Now the title of this video reads Dollar General employee arrested for stealing eight thousand dollars in snacks with your big ass. How the hell you steal eight thousand dollars in snacks? It, it can't be in one wop. Don't tell me they done said over time. She probably been working there for some years, maybe a good two, three years. And they've been building the case on her big back ass. Just all of the little Debbie snacks, all the Twinkies, everything. Over time, they've been docking her ass. And they going to finally hit her with an $8,000 charge once she done dug herself deep in that hole tell me that ain't what happened tell me she had to have done this in like one or two wops you know what i'm saying she stole a big old uh big variety of snacks in one tape and another you know Anyway, let me spoil my situation though, man. Let's not waste no more time. Go ahead and make sure that like button lit up. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you're a newcomer around here. Let's go ahead and get up into the video right now. If you ain't fucking with my nigga Sheldon, nigga, fuck you. Yeah. Um, we had an employee that let things come out of the store. Okay. About a thousand dollars worth of stuff. And Is this her? Yeah. Okay. She said a thousand dollars worth? Cause why I say a thousand dollars and the title say eight? Folk be capping, man. Hold on, let's see. Um, we had an employee that let things come out of the store. We had an employee as if the employee is not right there. And she's talking about some. <laughs> we had an employee. Man, gone. Um, we had an employee that let things come out of the store. Okay. About a thousand dollars worth of stuff. And Is this her? Yes. Yeah. Okay. On March 4th, 2022, officers in Florida responded to a local Dollar General where an employee was accused of stealing over one thousand dollars worth of food and various other items. How y'all doing? Hi. Do you know what manager called? So it was one thousand dollars worth of food, or was it various other items up in that one thousand dollars as well? Where does eight come in from? Because that's what the title say. Okay, you're the one who called. Yes. What's going on? When the officer arrived, the manager would explain how the scheme worked and how the employee was able to steal thousands of dollars in various snack and food items from the store. And he said thousands with an S this time, so maybe we're about to find out. Let's see. Yeah. Okay. So, is there a loss prevention person we need to talk to? I have. I can call her. Okay, do you both have IDs? I do. It's in my room, sorry. Damn. Is that her belly or is there snacks in front of her? Hey, 
you doing? Good, how are you? Good. All righty. What's going on? She announced him. She didn't say she, I got caught stealing. $8,000 worth of snacks and kept walking. Nah, she just kept on walking. They let her freely walk over there to retrieve her shit. Usually, usually they they escort your ass. So this happened over a span of four hours yesterday? What the fuck was she trying to do? What was she trying to do? Stock up for the winter? What the fuck? That was the loss prevention manager, basically. I hadn't got the manager's statement, but apparently she already wrote a statement to her. So she... It all happened yesterday. It's just one instance. Okay. Over the span of four hours yesterday. Okay. One instance over a span of four hours? What? The employee allowed her aunt, the employee's aunt, to basically load up entire carts of whatever. I mean, over $1,000 worth of stuff. And she would scan, like, one or two things. She would? The employee would, yeah, the employee would scan. So she was under scan? Yeah, the, the employee would scan one or two things and let the aunt walk out. She wants to press charges. So they're both going to go. If we, they don't know the aunt's name. Hold on. Employee. Hold up. So she wasn't actually stealing? She was helping folks steal by just scanning one and two items? Maybe she was in on the two. That was going, some of that shit was for her. Yo, yo, I refuse to believe it. I got to back it up one more time and I'm going to turn the police out, uh, turn the police officer up a little bit because it's a little hard to hear him. I want to make sure y'all able to hear what he said. And I'm trying to make sure that I caught everything that he said. I hadn't got the manager's statement, but apparently she already wrote a statement to her. So she... It all happened yesterday. It's just one instance. Okay. Over the span of four hours yesterday. Okay. The employee allowed her and the employee's aunt basically load up entire carts of whatever I mean over a thousand dollars worth of stuff and she would scan like one or two things she would the employee would yeah the employee would scan so she was under scan yeah the, the employee would scan one or two things and let the aunt walk out she wants to why the fuck he keeps saying the employee, the employee, he and, and the other officer saying she would, she would. Yeah. Nigga, we trying to make sure, we trying to get a clear indication of who it is. You talking about some the employee. There's several fucking employees, nigga. So he's saying her? He keeps saying the employee. The manager is an employee too. The fuck are you talking about? Damn. If we, they don't know the aunt's name, and the employee apparently wouldn't tell her. So, um, but yeah. So, but I, she, apparently, you want me? I'll go inside with the manager. Get there. Yeah, I need the surveillance video, and if they can give us an idea of what all was taken, we need a receipt. Yeah. Let me go. She should have all that. Go ahead and have all that ready. Okay. I'll go in there with her, get all that. Okay, do that. I'll Mirandize her and talk to her real quick. And okay. But apparently she already admitted everything on their written statement, so... That's fine. Okay. All right. I'll go with my other spot. Wow. 
Alright, I'm gonna read you something and ask you a few questions. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer, have him or her present with you while you're being questioned. You cannot afford to hire a lawyer. One will be appointed to represent you before any questioning if you wish. You wish to speak to me about this incident. That's fine. He don't know that motherfucker by heart. I think they should make them know that bad boy by heart before they leave the academy. And they should not have to have a card unless they got some kind of uh, dementia or something like that. Some kind of situation to where they forgetful. Because what the hell, you know what I'm saying? That, that That's something that they should be able to memorize right there. You feel me? Mm. Yeah, because it's kind of a tricky situation. That's the statement she wrote. Yeah, with her aunt. So, her, I mean, her knowingly scanning and yeah. allowing her to steal, that's a criminal offense in itself, but... Well, about 15 minutes ago, the ladies who were the last ones to come through with stuff came back in, and their carts are still sitting over there when they realized I wouldn't let her come out and ring them out. Okay. Um, the only... I have pictures of the transaction from the register because it wouldn't let me reprint them. Okay. So... This is what she rang up. That's what she gave away. And I can show you on the big camera too. And then she rang up a drink and that's the cart he pushed out. And the only thing she rang up was the drink? The drink, yeah. That's the actual receipt for the transaction. Okay. And that's on the drum drive. Can you, oh, that's, this is all on the drum drive? Yeah. <laughs> so um, I can take this, right? Yes. Cool. Um, she told me to have it all ready, so. Yeah, that makes everything will easier. Hey. Give her a shake of I'm just gonna put my stuff here. You trying to be nosy. Girl gone, you trying to be nosy. You trying to get a little stuff, a little, little something so you can go back and tell somebody, yeah, man, I was just in there putting my stuff up and I heard them say something about they going to convict her. They going to press some charges. They trying to do something. Somebody stole somebody. Yeah, you going to go back with some kind of little information. This is what you were fishing for. Yeah. I know it. I know it. I know it. It's all good. And she put her employee number. I didn't. Um, I don't know if you need the original or the copy. I was just told to make a copy of it. So. And then these are like when I went through and watched the video. I didn't put all of this on there because it wouldn't have fit. But what is all? Oh, okay. This is and this is the list of stuff I could see in the cards that got taken. Can you do? Did you make copies of all that? No, not yet. You make copies of all that front yeah. and back, if you would. You will be placed under arrest for grand retail theft. Yes. Um. Tell me what's going on, like, you're being accused of underscanning and allowing your aunt to walk out. Mm. <laughs> like, I could, you know how many different felonies you can get from this? It's organized retail theft, basically, is what it is. Whether it was your idea or not, you went along with it. Did you get dropped off here, or is your vehicle in the My vehicle's here. Okay. Hey, um, I'm getting ready to go to jail. Mm. Someone come get it. Because I let somebody walk out of here with stuff yesterday. They're on the phone. What? Why? Who? Why? So I thought she was calling her aunt that she allowed to walk out. Because this who she said they, they said this who, what? Ain't this who they said she allowed to walk out, right? Uh, grand retail theft. Yes. Um... Tell me what's going on, like, you're being accused of underscanning and allowing your aunt to walk out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. Now she's going to jail. I don't know. So, I will let you know when I can get a bond hearing or whatever. No, you'll have a bond tonight, said by me. Hold on, did I skip something? Hey, um, I'm getting ready to go to jail. <laughs> Can you have someone come get it? Because I let somebody walk out of here with stuff yesterday. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know. Because I let somebody walk out of here with stuff yesterday. You see how she tried to frame it? Instead of saying... 
I allowed such and such to get a basket full of stuff and I only scanned a few items instead of saying what it was. Of course, we're not going to snitch on ourselves. No, nah, we're not going to do that. But you see how she did it? You, you, did you catch it? I caught it. I'm just saying. You feel me? I don't blame her. So, I just caught it. I will let you know when I can get a bond hearing or whatever. No, you'll have a bond tonight set by me. He said I'll have a bond setting set tonight. I'm not sure how much it was. Mm. Where's your keys at for your vehicle? Are you able to have someone come get it? Because obviously you're not going to be allowed back on this property. He's going to call my aunt. Oh. Shelly? No. Okay. Oh, it's another aunt. My Maybe it's the same aunt. She just lying. She don't want to give up. Cause they look. They probably looking for her ass too. You know. Aunt Judy. Okay. Yeah, aunt Judy, huh? Shelley? I don't have anything for her. She made it very secretive. So I guess this is why. Where are you going? I'm gonna go get my purse and stuff and put it in my car. Is it inside? You ain't got your aunt phone number. You ain't got your auntie phone number. Huh? She made it secretive. <laughs> and I guess this is why. Faking it. Yo. Now it was all her idea. Do I need to take my idea with me? Um, not necessarily. Um... I would take your cell phone with you so you can get phone numbers out of it. Um, and then I'll just put my cigarettes and my keys and everything in my purse. Or... Because I have your information so you don't necessarily need your ID. Okay. Um, it wouldn't hurt to take your wallet and phone with you, but that's really your choice. And I'll leave my ring and... Do I need to take earrings and everything out? Or? <laughs> Me too, at the jail, yeah. Is it just your purse inside? I believe so, yes. So she took eight shopping carts? Hey. All together and the hour, it was eight shopping carts for the stuff. Wow, so she came back. Is that what happened? And I refuse to believe that was all just for the auntie. She was going to get some of that shit, too. Hell yeah. She, and still got it. Number come from? When she got out. It was probably over that amount. Because yeah. there were coats full of things that we couldn't even see what was in them. Um, so, what she's estimating. And you didn't happen to get her on video writing the statement, did you? Yes. She Actually. is on video writing the statement? Yes. Is I that, can add that to that. Yeah, if people wouldn't do that, that would just be a little icing on the cake, so to speak. So to speak. And uh, what I'll do is I'll just take the copied version of everything. Okay. And snakes. So the, the receipts you have are on here, you said. They lying. It was... Um, well, I have the See, titles be lying like a motherfucker. They be said $1,000 worth of food and other various items. So, other various items. Unless this A difference between food and snacks. Is the other various items the snacks and food is... You see what I'm saying? Like, the other various items could be clothes and shit like that. You know? Beginning, like, where she scanned one thing. And then gave them their copy of the receipt, and they walked out with two carts full of stuff. Okay, cool. Back on there. Nah, she ain't steal no eight thousand dollars worth of just no damn snacks. I refuse to believe that they 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 reaching for that. They reaching with that. Okay. If you guys need anything else, I can. If we can do it all from here, we don't actually have to wait for them to send it to us, which is kind of nice. Yeah, this is a good starting point right here. So, how long has she been working here? At this store, only a couple months. Mm. Not even a month. Not even a month. The other Anthony store, so the way she did it, I have a feeling that this is not the first time. Yeah, I'm sure. And 
wasn't. And she wouldn't last give y'all her. She wouldn't give y'all her aunt's name. I don't. It looks like her mom. Say it looked like her mom. It could have been, or it could have been her her aunt, cause she, you know, family look alike. But she said it looked like her mom. And they were driving a red van, cause you can kind of mm -hmm. see it off to the side. Did cause she walks out to it. And were y'all able to get? Y'all have outside cameras. Uh, but you can see the van in the corner. Uh, I, I was just wondering if you were able to get a tag, if it was gonna be a. If I can get a tag number from the video, but probably no, not from that no. angle. You can only see the side of it. So she gonna get away. That would probably help us identify. Unless you give her up. Identify the aunt or her mom or whoever it is, you know. Where's that? Nah, she okay. getting away. Okay. Well, y'all can forget this is what that. I from you is gonna be, hey, uh, on this day, yesterday, um, or. This morning. This morning when you saw the video or whatever, just say, hey, on video I saw our employee, her false name, um, <laughs> false ringing. Okay. And then mention, you know, what you saw. You you watched the video, you saw the, the lady putting, whatever you saw, the lady putting stuff in the basket, a male getting it out, okay. the two black females. Like I said, I don't need all Two the black females, what? Right here. Um, I have a witness statement for him. I'm actually... Damn. They had some black females with them? Oh, man. How did it go down then? Oh, okay. Yeah, that, I'm actually going to give you. just come outside with me. What the hell? Or did the police officer just throw that in there? Just two black females? Nobody said shit about no two black females up until now. Mmm. I'm just saying. So, it's not Excuse me. I'm sorry, baby. <laughs> I got the, she's going to come out and do a witness statement. She ain't got no shoes on. But you got your shoes off for a big girl. Yeah, she's doing all that. Where's her purse? And, oh, oh yeah, her I'm fine. Will you grab my shoes, please? What? Whose shoes are those? Mine. Oh. My work shoes. Okay. I have slides. Oh, okay. You gonna take, you gonna run the slides in the jail? Don't forget the keys for a car and lock Look at this out. nigga dome. This nigga got a cranium up there. Look at this nigga head. This nigga head pointing. This nigga head pointing like a motherfucker. That nigga got a... That nigga head, what the, a box head ass boy. That nigga head is a square for real. Look, and he barely got a chin. That nigga got a little, uh, a little wiggle of a chin. That nigga chin, look at that nigga chin. Maybe that's the angle. That gotta be the angle for the chin. That head is that though. That's that head though. That nigga chin might be, let's see. You got all that. Your person. Yeah, that's that angle because that nigga chin come forward like that head, dude. That nigga was a preemie. Oh, oh yeah. Will you grab my shoes, Shout out to the preemies. He just looked like one. <laughs> he looked like an adult preemie. Whose shoes are those? Mine. Uh, my work shoes. Ugly as hell. I have slides. Oh, okay. Look at him. For a car and lock everything up. And that nigga. So you have a family member that's going to come get your car? Where do you want to leave your keys? I'll just leave the door unlocked. You sure? Probably not the greatest idea. <laughs> Probably not the greatest idea. We aren't letting know. Hmm. Nigga, that's all you did. Yeah, you don't look in there like that. The Let me see. Precaution I gotta take. She could still have a a whole pump in that bad boy. <laughs> Do you have any money to bond yourself out of jail or anything? No. 
then you can leave it in here. If you want to take your ID with you, you can. I'll mm. bring your ID, your that, and your cell phone. Diesel. I do have fake teeth. Am I gonna have to leave those with you guys too? I have, that's a good. I have no idea. You got your cell phone? Damn fake teeth. <clears throat> oh, black cat. Bad look. <laughs> That's what they say. I ain't. I'm just saying. I don't believe in this shit. But it's her day. Today. It sound like I heard that cat. And it sound like it's following her ass. You hear it right now. Get this going. That cat done followed her ass all the way over there. Yeah, it's your day, baby. Just put your hands in the front. <coughs> and, the and this is just eczema. I don't have like. No. I got it. He like. No, that's not. I thought it was just birth marks that you had. Ain't no damn birthmarks. Shut your ass up. Goofy ass. I thought it was a birthmark. Nigga, shut up. You knew it was some other than birthmarks. Or less. Well, it's a misdemeanor. <coughs> I'm watching, I guess. So. How, how do they know? I guess they followed around the store and watched what Well, they got stuff. video cameras. I mean, everywhere. All over the place. All over yeah, the place. I know. So, you know, they, they invest big money into that kind of thing. And before <coughs> they call us, they do their due diligence. So. Are they saying this is the only time? <coughs> They suspect other people? Uh, right now, this is all this is all they're saying, and that's all she said. This is the first and only time. As of right now, they're probably still investigating that ad. Um, so until we know otherwise, yeah, we're just treating this like a isolated ordeal. So. And this happened April 4th, 2022, according to the body camera footage. The woman was given a few complimentary nights in jail. Mm. According to court records, the scheme was bigger than what officers expected. Not the previous store had a similar loss. To well, bam. Let me back that up. He giving us a, he giving us the tea. He giving us the tea. The woman was given a few complimentary nights in jail. According to court records, the scheme was bigger than what officers expected. Mm -hmm. The previous store had a similar loss totaling just over $8,000, <clears> where the employee would allow her mother to walk in and steal various food and snack items. Thank you for watching. Mm -hmm. Well, damn. It was food and snack items. <laughs> so she stole over a thousand dollars at this one, and uh, another one totaling over eight thousand at the other one. Mm. Well, damn, that is right there, man. Big big baby gotta eat. Big baby gotta eat. You feel me? Anyway, if you vibe all the way up until this point, I really do appreciate you. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Until next time, I'm Sheldon the Vibes. I'm going to need y'all to be cool. Like the other side of the pillow. Stay light on your toes like you suppose. Oh, yeah, no. If you ain't fucking with my nigga Sheldon, nigga, fuck you. Yeah. Oh, God.